and mission and philosophy of the energy business that not only he has brought it all around Malaysia but all around the world including opening up new countries wherever he goes ladies and gentlemen please put your hands together and give the biggest round of applause to Mr. Okay, here we are. 
Okay, uh, live feed. I need you to zoom in into the board here. Okay? And for you guys, would you mind coming down? Hey, thank God, you have the privilege. You all can sit down there. The, 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 the big arm chairs. Whoa. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, there's two more chairs here. Okay? Uh, okay, but uh, don't stay there for the remaining. Uh... <laughs> Is everybody here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I have a question for all of you. Okay? But I'm going to just take the answers from the six volunteers. But this question is to all of you. <laughs> Who you are today? Who are you today? What makes you who you are today? My question, what makes you who you are today? Wait, no, no, no. It's only for the six volunteers here. Tell me, Jerry, what has caused you to be who you are today? What do you think causes you to be who you are today? Tell me. Just shout it out. Big ghost. Big ghost. How are you? No, who you are today, who you are today. What has been the determining forces of your life? What was it? John, your family. Who you are today? Marcia. Who you are today? Who, okay, let me ask the audience here. Who you are today, right? Has it been the cause of your past? Who agree that you are who you are today because of your past experiences? Yeah. Say aye. aye. No. Who said that? You are not part of the equation for this purpose. Okay, because you know what I'm talking about. So don't steal it from them. Who you are today? Your education. Is it past? Is it past? Can your past education be a cause in? In, in deciding who you are today? Yes. Your, your association with the people in your life. That's also another determining cause. Your past failures. Your past successes. Your past disappointments. Your past hurts. Your pains, your humiliation. Hey, who here is honest? Say hi. Hey, hello, very few, very many dishonest people. I'm going to ask one more time. Who here is honest? Hi. Still, many dishonest. <laughs> who here, you have, been, you have suffered self humiliation? Guys, for the rest of you who are not participating, you have to up your level of participation because don't miss it. Don't miss this. You are here to make million bucks. Yes. So don't, don't, look, I'm not a power speaker. I concede, but what I'm going to share with you is going to change you if you participate with me. Do you want to make me, who here wants, wants to make a million bucks? So you need to participate. Yes. Right. Let me explain here. Who you are today is the result of your past. Your past is causing you to be who you are today. Right? And the present, and then the thing is, is, we get into a vicious cycle. We get into a vicious cycle. From past experience, you do certain things, you say certain things, you have certain ideas about things. And this is recurring and recurring. 
A vicious cycle. How many of you relate with that? Yes. Now I'm going to share something which is so simple. Right? I also fall into the, into the trap. It is a trap. Tell your neighbor it is a trap. <laughs> Sometimes I fall into my vicious cycle, my past. And you know, how many of you here are shy? Well, so many people shy. Huh? <laughs> if you are the honest ones, of course, the other people are not shy, they don't feel pick up your, put up their hand. One more time, for the shy people, for the really shy people, this is a chance for you to be really be authentic with yourself. Who are the shy people in the room? Wow, half the room, huh? Good. So I also fall into my shyness sometimes. My, I, I, some, many times I, I get into, I go, I go back into my shell. Do you know what I mean? Yes. I do that. And you know, actually I've been, I've been hiding in my shell for some time. I've been hiding in my shell for some time. And in fact, remember I was telling your brother that uh, I was going to buy my car tomorrow, <laughs> right? So since I decided to buy six months ago, right? I want to buy yes. When I get into my shell, no. I'm going to buy, yes. After that, go back to it's not my shell again, no. And then I want to buy again, I pay the deposit. I actually pay the deposit of my car. Any of you interested in what car I'm getting? Yes. I'll tell you later, the rest are not interested. <laughs> it is a car which costs 1.3 million ringgit. <laughs> Now, I'm buying the car. I think it's, I think I'll be an idiot. I think it's quite idiotic to buy a car which is worth one point three million. If the money is better spent buying a property, right? Yeah. Would you agree? Yeah. So I'm not buying the. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, listen. The new range will cost one point three million. Ring it. I'm not that idiotic to buy a new Range Rover. I'm buying a one-year-old Range Rover, which goes for half the price. Make sense? Yes. So, uh, so I'm out from the shell again. Why? Because two days ago I did an exercise with two of my colleagues, Anson and David Nigel. They are on their way to become a Kangen Grandmaster. <laughs> Say to your neighbor, Kangen Grandmaster. Kangen Grandmaster. <laughs> now, would you interested to know what is the Kangen Grandmaster? Yes. A Kangen Grandmaster is what I define as somebody who prospects, who can do the demo, who can do the business plan, who can conduct who can train the new guys to be successful in Penguin. One more criteria. Anywhere in the world. Who was, who here in the room wants to be a Penguin Grandmaster? Say hi. hi. When you are a Penguin Grandmaster, you're set for life. Now, I, I, I know there are some Penguin, many of you here are Penguin Grandmasters already. Who here in the room are already you, you believe that you are already a Kangen Grandmaster. Put on your hands. Wow. Okay, now, I'm going to go into that technology now. Are you all ready? Yes. So how do I get up from my, how do I get up from my shell, my, 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 my shell, to be, to be powerful is this? How many of you here, before I, before I get into that, right? how many of you here, you, you would like to, let's say, assuming, come, okay, I want to see from a show of hands, who here in the room, right, today is uh, November, let's say in six months from today, in six months from today, if you want to be making an equivalent, an equivalent of 5,000 US or 20,000 ringgit from a show of hands, 
Now, would it be good for you, uh, all right, to take that level, all right, to bring it up? Now, you don't want to make just 5,000 US or 20,000 US. You want to make five times that. Hello? So, I'm going to give you a technology to do that. Because many, many of us, when we are stuck in our own ways, we are stuck in our shell. I can only make 5,000 US, I can only make 20,000 uh, ringgit. For me to go and make beyond that, what, make five times that, are you mad or you crazy? So, here it is. The future. I don't live in my past. I live into my future. My past is shy, not courageous, always fearful of failing. How many of you have this fear of failing and humiliation? How many of you? Can you continue to live with those? Past. No. Easy for you to say. Yeah. But they're stuck. Yeah. It is a vicious cycle. So how can you get to live into your future? How can you get to live into your future? Bowson. Gain more knowledge? John. Sorry? Start seeing results, okay? So you're saying you need to see results before you progress. Okay, alright. Marshall? Exposure? Work harder, okay? Learn more? Commitment? You know the, the, the answer I'm going to give to you uh, was, has been repeated over and over again. Has been repeated over and over again by several speakers today. What is it? Decision. Decision. What else? Goals. Focus. Habits. Okay, all those. But I'm going to do an exercise now. I'm going to do an exercise now. For you to experience it. Would it be good for you to experience it? And you can get unstuck. The word is unstuck. Say to your neighbor, unstuck. Unstuck. <laughs> if you are making, if your idea is you want to make 5,000 US or 20,000 ringgit six months from today, right? And if you're stuck, oh no, you want to make five times that. But you're stuck in, in that you can only make 20,000 ringgit or 5,000 US. Can you progress to make five times that? No. For some, for some of you, maybe uh, to make 5,000 5, US a month or 20,000 ringgit a month is really like, it's really, you have your doubts in your head that you can achieve it. How many of you can relate to what I'm saying? So now I need to. David, are you back here? Can you come, come here? Bring the stuff to the front. So volunteers, can you all stand up? Can you come here to this side? What I want you to do is this. I just let me see the, the space. I forgot to check the space. Okay, there's one hour, two hour, three hour, four hour, five hours. Okay? Now can you can two of you be in the middle? Two of you be in the middle. And two go to this side. So there's one hour there. Jerry, there's an hour just behind this sofa chair, okay? There's another arm okay, on the side. Okay, here you, are, you two have to share one arm. John, there's one arm out there. Can you open it? And Rob Lawson, oh, you don't go yet. Okay. Now, I want you now to walk as fast as you can to the back of the room as far as you can get to and come back first. You go first. You go first. Okay. And you, John, go as well. You don't have to run, just walk briskly. Jerry, 
No, uh, then come to the front, the start, okay? Yeah, walk briefly. You also walk, not to the end. And then you can start walking there and back. Start, uh, walk briefly. Fantastic. Hey. Okay, I thought you was participating. <laughs> Wait, wait, come back. So the, the next thing I want, want you to do is this. Can each of you bring a... If all of you come and get this basket? Okay? I want to just... Uh, let me hold on to yours. Uh, let me hold on to yours. Okay? Go back to your respect, respective places. Go back to your respective places. No, 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 no. Now what I want you to do now is, I want you to put your feet, the foot, one foot, into the basket. Just do it. Now, are you ready? No, 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 let me just demonstrate first. I want you to do the same, walk to the back and walk to the back of the room and back to the front like this. Go, go. 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 <laughs> you are supposed to keep the basket in good shape and not damage it. Okay, all of me come to the front now. All of me come to the front. Come to the stage without the... Bring the basket to the stage. Okay? Come on to the stage. So, how was the experience uh, of the first time when you walk without any constraints? Now the word is called constraint. Constraints. Right? The first time you walk is without the basket. The second time you walk is with the basket. So how has been the experience of this exercise for you? Well, first, first time it's very easy, second time a little bit tough. So, what do you learn from that? So, yeah, so if I, uh, we want to move in future, uh, we should left past. Not uh, we can move in future with past. Okay. But, uh, what I really want to hear is, if you have gotten a new realization, has there been a new realization that like I spoke to you just now? You asked you how much you want to be making six months from today. You said you want to be making 20,000 ringgit. So, what has been your realization from this exercise? If there is any realization. Um, that when you, when I felt like I cut the shackles off, so I can aim bigger. I can, I can go aim bigger, faster, with ease. Right. So what is those shackles? Share with us. What, what shackles are those? Like what? a chain that ties you? No, no, I'm talking about in real life. Oh, shackles. Are, are you okay to share that? Yeah. Okay. Uh, shackles like in the business? Yeah. Um, objections? Okay. Um, people not joining the business? Okay. Yeah. Um, so let me ask you. Let me ask you this. So just now you, when we met in the, outside in the room, your, your, your goal was to make how much per month in, in six months time? Right? Your first answer. Your first answer. 20,000 minimum. 20,000 minimum. Personal answer. But after this experience, after this experience, do you see yourself making 20,000 ringgit or less or more? More. How much more? 50 minimum. 50. You sure or not? Yeah. Why? <laughs> I learned that uh, it's your mindset that keeps you stuck. Uh, keeps you stuck to that level. Okay, alright. 
Who would like to share him? Yes, John. Yeah, walking the first time, you feel more free. You can walk fast and uh, with uh, you know strength and direction. Second time, you seem to walk. You have to think more about you know something that's holding you down the whole time. So you have to walk slower. All right. Because of the things holding you back. But how can you relate this exercise to this past, future, uh, past, present, and future? How can you relate this exercise to them? Well, going into the future, you will be. Uh, well, you need to get rid of the, the bucket in your life. Exactly. Yeah. Right? And so are you... I'm going to give you a technology on how you can do that. Right? What has been your experience for yourself? It's been my experience that, mm -hmm. that you can follow leaders <coughs> run through the process and leverage your, leverage your time. Okay. Thank you. Marsha, did, did you gain anything from this exercise? Did you gain anything? No, no, yes. yes, okay, uh, of course, definitely. Uh, with the basket, is of course more challenging. However, you have to still go it until the finish line. Just move forward. Okay. Thank you. Great, thank you. Just share your realizations. Uh, for the first time without the basket, it was very comfortable. Of course, with the basket, which is uh, something which I need, it makes me a bit more difficult. But if the goal that I want to finish it, I will. Right, okay, good. Let's give all of this a big hand. All right, thank you so much. Let us uh, go back to the seat. Now, the thing is this. Do you now see that you are constrained by your past? Tell your neighbor, constrained. Constrained. Now, I, there's a technology where you can get rid of this constraint. So imagine yourself, right? You are shackled and you want to move forward. You cannot. Why? Because you have your past experiences, you have your failures. And you don't think that you can. Go back, go back and do this exercise where you're in the basket. Now what if I tell you, if you can spend three days in, in an event, which can get, help you get rid of your past constraints. Past constraints. Who would be interested to attend such an event like that? What value would it give to you? Imagine, imagine living a life with no constraints. No constraints. Simon, would you like that? Emma, do you have any constraint? Currently? Yeah. Yeah. Do you have any constraints, uh, Nigel? Yes. Do you have any constraints, uh, John? Today? Yeah. Can I ask the room here? Who here is honest? I am. <laughs> Who here, you have a constraint right now which is preventing you from going fast? You need to. There's a program called Landmark Forum. <coughs> Forum. Landmark Forum, one word. Dot com. Now, Landmark Forum, unfortunately, is not in Malaysia. By the way, who has attended the Landmark Forum before? From sure. Can you just be the comments, Danny? Set up. Wow, so many of you, so many Indians. <laughs> Lemma Forum, go and check it out. LemmaForum.com. They, in the Lemma Forum, the constraints that the past imposes on you just disappears.
Okay. Can you zoom in there to the wording? All right. In the landmark forum, everybody look at the board. In the landmark forum, the constraints that the past that the past imposes on you disappears. How powerful is that? Hello? Very, very powerful. Very, very powerful. So, I, I was, I've been stuck before, and sometimes, you know, we are human, right? We, moving forward one day, and come back again, like, like you know, I, I, I told you, I was going to buy the car, and I turned back. It is the past which gets you stuck. And I still fall back to that. So I have to break free from that and go forward. I think it's time I go back to the Lemma Forum again. Who would like to join me? Go to the Lemma Forum. Alright? Now in the Lemma Forum, you can find it in Singapore, you can find it in Thailand, yeah. India, India, London, Hong Kong. I would I would urge all of you. By the way, I, I don't get paid for introducing you to this event, right? But my, my recommendation to you is this. Get yourself in there. Get yourself in there if you want to make five times more money than you're making today. And they're also in Manila, I believe. Alright, with that, I thank you for your participation. Thank you.